I'm Mike for Path and Post Real Estate, and in this video, we're talking about buying land. When purchasing land for recreation, investment, farming, development, or to build your dream home, the process requires more steps than buying a home that's already built. Understanding what to expect and following key guidance can help avoid taking on too much risk and create a smooth transaction. The first step in buying land is making sure you can qualify for a land loan or a construction loan if you're not paying cash. Lenders consider vacant land a riskier investment than financing a house that's already built. Talking to a trusted lender to be sure your dream of owning land comes to fruition is definitely step one. Land loans are different from traditional mortgages because the higher costs reflect the amount of risk taken on by the bank to finance an undeveloped property. Land loans usually require a higher down payment, a higher interest rate, and a shorter term to pay off the loan. They're often done at a local bank or a credit union where the financial institution is much more likely to specialize in rural and agricultural lending. If the plan is to build right away, a construction loan with a bank or mortgage company may be preferred. Construction loans offer better interest rates and terms, and a construction to permanent loan, also referred to as construction to perm, can include financing for both construction and the land purchase. This type of loan would have interest on the balance paid monthly up to 12 months during construction, then the loan is converted to a permanent loan upon completion of the new home. Once you find the right land to buy, the next step is to analyze the suitability of the land for your specific needs, which involves the buyer investing time and money into doing testing, research, and analysis. The time period in a contract for you to analyze if the land will work for your goals is called due diligence and can be as much as 30 to 90 plus days. To avoid surprises or unforeseen expenses, it's important for the buyer to do proper due diligence when buying raw land. Many of the recommended due diligence steps take considerable time to complete. As soon as a contract is binding, these steps should be started quickly. I'm not going to read all these to you. That would make a super boring video. That said, if you are considering buying land, please pause here and review the steps in detail. They really are important. If the goal of buying land is to build a custom home, keep in mind that building a custom home from scratch is usually more expensive than buying an existing home or building in a neighborhood where the builder owns lots and builds all the homes. That doesn't make it worse, though. Building a custom home on your own land can be a wonderful experience. It's a great way to get exactly what you want. You select everything from the ground up, including the land, floor plan, builder, materials, and finishes. It doesn't just help you build a connection with your new house, but it also ensures that the place you call home is one of a kind. The key to all of this is to remember that you're not alone. Let's face it, whether you're building a home on it or keeping it for recreational use, very few people buy land all day every day. It's key to have a strategic guide walk with you in this journey to becoming a landowner to make sure you're prepared for each step and ensure the process goes smoothly and with less hassle and risks. Find your strategic guide at pathpost.com.